who will uh, uh, present to you uh, their first report. Uh, that I'm concerned that cases of COVID-19 continue to rise, putting further pressure on stretched health systems and health workers, and also concerned about the increasing trend of deaths. The Emergency Committee on COVID-19 met on Friday last week and concluded that the virus remains a public health emergency of international concern. Yes, thank you so much. Just curious about um, the, the... The committee noted their concern about several interlinked challenges. First, subvariants of Omicron like BA4 and BA5 continue to drive waves of cases, hospitalization, and death around the world. Second, surveillance has reduced significantly, including testing and sequencing, making it increasingly difficult to assess the impact of variants on transmission, disease characteristics, and the effectiveness of countermeasures. Third, diagnostics, treatments, and vaccines are not being deployed effectively. Thank you. Um, so my question is about um, the distribution. As transmission and hospitalizations rise, Governments must also deploy tried and tested measures like masking, improved ventilation, and test and treat protocols. I urge governments to regularly review and adjust their COVID-19 response plans based on the current epidemiology and also the potential for new variants to appear. Governments should also work to reverse the reduction in surveillance, testing, and sequencing and share antivirals effectively. Vaccines have saved millions of lives, and it's important for governments to focus on boosting those most at-risk communities, finding the unvaccinated so as to build up the wall of immunity toward the 70% vaccination target. Pox. Um, I know, Dr. Tedros, you mentioned a little bit about that. I was wondering if you could say... New waves of the virus demonstrate again that the COVID-19 is nowhere near over. As the virus pushes at us, we must push back. Times, India. Ashwin, if you are with us, please unmute yourself. On monkeypox, there are now 9,200 cases in 63 countries. The Emergency Committee for Monkeypox will reconvene next week and look at trends how effective the countermeasures are, and make, recommend, make recommendations for what countries and communities should do to tackle the outbreak. Observer Times India, with this, uh, we will conclude today's uh, press conference.